Hey, what's up folks? In this project, we're building a smart fume extractor with CircuitPython and the Adafruit Funhouse. This uses a PC fan and an air quality sensor to make a fume extractor that can change speed based on the quality of the air. The fan is controlled with PWM using an EMC 2101 fan controller. A mini fan in the center helps direct fumes to a SPG30 air quality sensor. The speed of the fan is mapped to the sensor so it'll automatically adjust when it senses any solder fumes. The sensor values and fan speed are displayed on the Funhouse's 1.5 inch TFT display. With CircuitPython and the Display I.O. library, you can use custom fonts in bitmap images. There's a carbon activated filter fitted over the PWM fan so it can absorb any solder smoke. All of the electronics are secured in a 3D printed enclosure with parts that snap fit together. The idea and code behind this CircuitPython project is from Liz Clark of Blitz City DIY. The main program takes readings from the sensor and maps it to the fan's RPM. On boot up, you can decide to connect to Wi-Fi and log data to a feed using Adafruit I.O. Text objects are updated on the display and values are printed in the serial console. Be sure to check out the code walkthrough by Liz on the Adafruit Learn system. With Adafruit I.O., you can create a visual dashboard of the sensor data and fan speed. Using a line chart, we can plot our sensor data and see it change over time by setting up our feeds. In the code, we can set how frequently to send data to a feed in Adafruit I.O. With your fumes in the cloud, you can use your mobile device to access your dashboard anywhere remotely. The wiring and assembly for this build is documented in our learn guide. There you can get the circuit diagram, demo code, and instructions on getting set up with CircuitPython. Our enclosure design in Fusion 360 features 3D models of the electronics with parts from GrabCAD and McMaster Car. The challenge in this project led to designing a cover for the mini fan to make better airflow. An opening just behind the sensor allows the fumes to exit through the back of the mount. The Adafruit Funhouse has lots of built-ins that make these type of projects great for folks who are just getting started. We hope this project inspires you to check out CircuitPython and Adafruit I.O.